All right guys, we're rolling out just before eight o'clock today, Saturday morning. Time to get an official morning ride on the new Custom Alley. Haven't done that yet, haven't made a video on it. Uh, sorry guys also for the lack of posting this past week. That's in a separate video, I've been uh, out sick, so I've been getting my, uh, my form back, my fitness back. Today, it's just scorching hot, so it's important to get out earlier. Got the water on the bike, lots of food. I'll show you what I'm eating throughout the day. Let's go do one run up the, uh, the Devil in Walnut Creek. Man, it's gonna be brutal, brutally hot today. I'm rocking the DNA Cycling race jersey. This thing's basically like a second skin, so it's gonna keep me nice and cool in those climbs. All sunscreened up, oiled up, got Lycra on. Let's go get some solid exercise. Make, 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 make money, take money, earn, earn, crack money, drug money, bail money. How they got life for me, how they got life for me when they took that for me. Since I had my nose, since I had my nose for me, yeah. I'm full of kilos, soul pounds and zeros. Cocaine, my hero, the flip lane fake side getting Debo. Always asking what to learn like. Young, young home still preload. Don't fly around, don't fly around my signal. I'll rearrange your dindle. Don't, 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 don't fly around my signal. Don't fly, don't fly around my signal. Don't, don't fly around my signal. I'll rearrange your dindle. Could be my house, you look like a cypher. Heard that I'm libo. You get the eyeball. Aim out the eyeball. I'm getting violent. 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 halfway through the ride right now and uh, I decided to change it up so I was gonna do uh, one time up Mount Diablo up and back it's like 3600 feet pretty easy and then I remembered the uh, my lips are probably disgusting I remembered the uh, Danville Peach ride was today which is just basically a bunch of very high-level cyclists coming out and just smashing it in the uh, in the middle of nowhere as you can kind of tell Guy from uh, Trek Sega Fredo was here today. That was pretty cool. You know, you don't usually see uh, cyclists at that high a caliber just like on a random group ride. So that's super cool. Sitting at uh, 1,700 feet, 54, or basically 55 miles. 96 degrees. Seventy-three point two nine miles. Still got a little ways to go. I'm gonna head back to the gym, take a shower, so that I'm fresh for work because I'm going to work um, in about forty minutes. So I'm gonna go to Chipotle, get some food, refuel, rehydrate, freshen up, go to work, get it done. That's how you start a day off the right way. And I think I'm gonna buy one of those super expensive protein shake things that they sell you at the gym. You know, I broke down a lot of muscle today and I think that is gonna taste like the best thing on earth. Alright guys, just got home after a pretty long day of exercise. I left this morning at 8 o'clock and it's 7 o'clock now, so that's 11 hours of exercise. Um, pretty intense as well, so we did the 55 mile um, 9 a.m. Danville Pete's ride, which is like all the hitters in the Bay Area come out to that thing. 
Trek Sega Fredo guy drove down from uh, Tahoe to ride it. So if you guys are in the Bay Area and you want a really hard group ride, the 9 a.m. Saturday Danville Pete's ride is amazing. Um, I always look for group rides that I get dropped on because uh, as your fitness progresses, you want to push yourself more and more with more advanced people. And uh, definitely found that there today. Then went over to uh, work. I had to stop at, uh, the, the, at Forma, the gym that I belong to. Had to take a cold shower. Um, but yeah, just getting home now. The, uh, oh, damn it. I was gonna show you guys how many calories I burnt, but the Garmin turned off. This was pretty, uh, pretty sketchy. It's not really attached on there too well. Um, did that little bodge job this morning, but we'll see how the footage turns out. This was the uh, the official morning ride on the alley, and I have to say, man, when you build up a bike and it just runs super smooth, it's a great feeling. But what a day! What a day on the bike. 4,000 calories, so I'm gonna get inside and start uh, working on that because I don't want to be in a calorie deficit. I'm already vegan. I'm wasting away as it is, so got to start. Uh, eating immediately to get those 4,000 calories back. So here's what I'm gonna be eating for, I guess the third dinner of the night. I've got like probably 300 grams of white pasta here. I'm gonna pour some of this vegan teriyaki sauce on to replenish those, uh, those salts that I lost today. Look at that one-handed one-handed soy sauce expert. Yeah, so we pour this on. We don't go easy because we want to climb just as well tomorrow. Uh, I just pounded back one of these, the regular ones. I'm gonna do a chocolate. These are like uh, 400 calories right there. We got the Whole Foods Field Roast. So these are like a really good, um, uh, yeah, I actually don't know what these are. We got some tofu. These are basically just like, it's a tofu frozen dinner, but it's got really good macros and micros. So good protein to carb to fat ratio. And uh, comes out, you know, just like that. Frozen stuff retains all the nutrients. Um, and then for dessert, a little, uh, little cashew yogurt. So pretty good. Yeah, man, super fun day on the bike. Remember to subscribe down below if you want to see more related to cycling, fitness, and nutrition. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace out.